Hi team. Uh, you can go ahead. Yeah. Hi team. Uh, coming today, coming to today, uh, we have uh, uh, an option like uh, to explain on uh, the one of the module in our uh, financial uh, fusion consultant. Uh, I have selected uh, the GL module. Uh, so we have a different modules also. We have like a GL, APAR, and uh, FA and CM. In that, I uh, have selected the GL. Uh, so coming to the GL, uh, uh, GL is a provide a complete setup of transaction and reports uh, for maintaining general ledger account, uh, general ledger control. So we have, uh, 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 so uh, the Oracle general ledger is a part of uh, uh, e-business suits and uh, integrated uh, suit for uh, of application that derives uh, uh, enterprise uh, um, uh, uh enterprise structures and uh, uh, we have uh, a, a lot of setups in the gl like uh, uh, uh currencies uh, uh calendars chart of accounts and uh, primary ledgers uh, in this way uh, we have uh, a few more setups uh, uh, these setups will be done uh, as a financial uh, consultant so uh, uh going on more uh, we have uh, these set setups uh, thank you uh, i will uh, continue with uh, another uh, person hello thank you uh Today I'm going to explain about the cash management, uh, which we are going to uh, uh, support with my other team members. Uh, the cash management uh, we are going to uh, include uh, with the other uh, applications and integrate with the other application, general ledger, accounts receivables, accounts payable and treasury management. Here, uh, looking and uh, taking for the cash management application with the Oracle help us to uh, real time visibility into cash positions of the business and automatic bank reconciliation, uh, better liquidity and risk management with the forecast of next five days and uh, upcoming uh, periods. So with the help of uh, other team members uh, and other uh, modules, uh, we are uh, giving the, and we are providing the seamless integration with different modules with the help of testing and providing you the support with the uh, different reports which help us to manage the business uh, in a proper way. Thank you. Next team. Next member. Yeah, I can do so. so Please. My, my name is Swami. I'm, I'm having uh, seven years of experience, out of which five years into Oracle Functional Consultant. Here, I'm going to explain about the accounts payable which is a key part of uh, financial model. So it deals with uh, department, I mean, it deals with responsibilities to, uh, to ensure that payments to suppliers are made on time and uh, the needs of uh, for flexibility in the organizations are met uh, as on time. For that, we need to have some setups and configurations. So uh, before implementing the accounts payable model, we have to focus on the few setups. So those are like uh, common options, invoice options, payments options, uh, disbursement system options, uh, distribution set, uh, tolerances, uh, payment terms, payments method, document sequence, payment template, payment format, payment process profile, internal bank accounts, uh, which includes uh, accounts, uh, bank, uh, bank name and branch name and bank account details. Along with that, we have to focus on this, uh, uh, the format like uh, checks or electronic or other white uh, transfer. And then vendor lookup scores and payable aging reports. Post that, we can focus on the uh, month end of uh, process and our year end process, then reconciliation for respective period. And we can go with the reports um, for basic reports like. Uh, uh, Posted invoice uh, register, posted payment register, and trial balance register. If there is any cons, if there is any issues in any uh, while uh, period uh, period and close time, 
uh, we can go with that exception reports and uh, sweep reports to focus on. Thank you. Good. Next. Next. Anyone like to share? I am KSP. I have experience of one year in supporting all of general general lecture. I am going to explain uh, the concept general lecture uh, or you degree your separate of uh, CA values. Your structure in instance. In general lecture, uh, it's a comprehensive financial management solution that provides highly financial processing, effective management, general lecture integration can refer to the process of connecting general lecture applications and other systems such as ERP, EPM, and asset management. The Oracle lecture value sets are uh, contents that define attributes and value sort of accounts segments. And uh, account structure uh, usually arranged uh, in the order, appear financial statements with the balance in accounts first and followed by the profit loss accounts. Instance is in the chart of account structure. Uh, an instance is a copy of a structure that shares the sum of the configurations as original. The chart of account structure defines the key attributes. Chart of accounts such as uh, number of segments and the order in their labels. <coughs> calendar in, in calendar, general lecture accounting in calendar will be used for uh, determining the period which financial transaction is due. It contains uh, extent uh, date due. No? Yeah. Okay, no problem. Next. Hi, everyone. I am Jonathan Jax. I have an experience of 10 years, uh, five years with a uh, real domain and uh, five years with uh, Oracle Cloud Financials. I am into, I am allocated to AP, AP process. AP, AP is nothing but accounts payable. Accounts payable model has a vital role and it is a sub digital application in Oracle Fusion and EBS. It was controlled under the BU, Business Unit Infusion, where it was controlled by operating unit in EPS. The main objective of AP is to calculate vendor's outstanding liability payables at organization level and to calculate the liability of organization toward the vendors. The account, uh, account payable team is responsible to fulfill the ensuring the payments to the supplier are made in time or not, and how we are managing the flexible relationship with the suppliers. The AP process typically involves in managing supply relationships, processing invoices, processing payments, reporting in analytics, and reconciliations. We have several uh, setups in uh, AP, like uh, configuring common options for payables and procurement, create reference data set, create payment, up, payment terms, configuring invoicing options, configuring payment options, and disbursement, disbursement options. We have, uh, we have, we need to create a dis distribution sets as well, and we have, we have to create suppliers, suppliers profile, address, site, and assign, assign site to the BU. We have to create bank, bank, uh, branch account, mm -hmm. and create payment process profile and open period. We have some concepts in uh, AP like uh, so. I just uh, I'm here to be here uh, to give use small review about that uh, concepts of AP. Uh, we have some concepts like a standard standard of invoice creation, PO creation, receipt based invoice creation, P2P, like a process to procure to pay, invoice creation via uh, spreadsheet. We have uh, we have a lot of lot of uh, scenarios in this. Uh, it will take uh, it will take uh, two two days to explain uh, the all scenarios. If you have any doubt, please. I mean, I, I am here with uh, I am here to explain uh, brief about these concepts as you are an uh, end user. Okay. Thank you. For, if you have any questions, please ask me. Thank you.